Hey, what's up, guys? This is Wood Geek. Welcome to part one of DBZBT3 The Saiyan Saga. I'll guide you. Hey, if you keep crying, I will break your neck. This is the fight with Goku's older brother, Raditz. Teaming up with Goku almost made me vomit. All right, let's go. The evil Saiyan Raditz has appeared. Goku and Piccolo are forced to team up to face this powerful enemy. The Z level battle has now begun. So. You actually came, how surprising. You know why I'm here. Give me back my son. So, you defy your own brother. I don't have a brother. Ha! <laughs> I thought you'd be slaughtered at this. It's disappointing that you're so foolish. Don't tell me you actually believe the two of you can win. Ridiculous. You don't stand a chance. Whenever you receive the prompt to press 1, it's an indication for you to progress the story. Press it to move on. Talk is cheap. Let's settle this. Don't make me laugh. And what exactly do you intend to do with those pitiful power levels? It takes more than strength to win a fight. We've got a strategy. Had enough of your smart mouth. Piccolo is a well-rounded fighter with potential for great melee combos. Keep him on melee and you'll do fine. His key attacks are pretty slow in comparison to how much damage he can deal with his fists. He's fast! <laughs> How do you feel about that? Are you okay, Piccolo? <laughs> it looks like your deaths are finally drawing near. I'm done trying to get through to you. You are a disgrace to our race! Prepare to die! Goku, like Piccolo, is pretty balanced as a fighter. He works well in any range, but again, you deal the most damage by using melee attacks. You can pull off combos that are somewhat difficult to do as other characters, but only if you know how to work with them. Do you have any special attacks I don't know about? <laughs> Sorry, can't say I do. Slacker. And here I've been training seriously, developing something new. <laughs> what are you two whispering about? Whatever strategy you devise, it won't work. You'd be better off just keeling over right now. Is it true you can do your new move with just one arm? Yeah, but it'll take some time for me to gather up enough energy. While I'm doing that, you fight him by yourself and draw his attention. Alright, you should be a good challenge. Now, we just got to stall him. As long as you can. Whatever strategy you devise, it won't work. You'd be better off just keeling over right now. You should have joined me when you had the chance. Instead, you chose death. You fool! Don't take your eyes off your opponent! You've got a lot of nerve! Take this! Piccolo, hurry! Your technique! Sorry to keep you away. Are you ready for this? Do it! Some story events in this game give you an automatic victory if you follow all the given signals to move on. This is one of them. Wait! Nowhere to run. Be gone! Trash! Blast! To think 
that I would be defeated by weaklings like this. <laughs> but everything that's happened here has been transmitted to my partners deep in space. In one year's time, they'll come. Two Saiyans even stronger than me. Enjoy yourselves as much as you can for the next year. <laughs> <laughs> it was a short-lived victory, wasn't it, you pathetic worms? I hate to put you out of your misery, but I've heard about as much from you as I can stand. Gohan, don't let your guard down. All right, let's go. The Saiyan Nappa possesses overwhelming power, and the Z Fighters fight desperately, waiting for Goku to arrive. Let me handle it. I'll put all five of them away in the blink of an eye. Ugh, the, the ground is shaking! Here he comes! You can find Dragon Balls in the story mode by crashing through any breakable terrain. They don't drop onto the ground like they did in Tenkaichi 2. Rather, as soon as you fly through the terrain containing a Dragon Ball, you get it. Chiaotzu is a fun fighter to play as, mostly because of his moving animation. He isn't strong melee-wise, meaning he has to rely on Key Blast and Blast 1 abilities to fight. That was a school thing to do. Looks like you still don't realize how powerful you are. Farewell, Tien. Please don't die. Goodbye, Tien! Shatsu has already been brought back once with the Dragon Balls. He can't ever be brought back again! Don't worry about your little friend. You'll meet him again soon enough. What's wrong? Tien is a strong but somewhat awkward fighter to use. There are a few moves he possesses that allow him to severely dent his opponent's health, but they can be tricky to pull off because of his way of moving. <laughs> it will soon be the end for you! No. Oh, you almost startled me there. Fool, he used up his power and died for nothing. Run! I'll try to hold him off somehow until my dad gets here! You're talking nonsense. There's no way you can stop him by yourself. Because if you die, Piccolo, then Kami dies too, and the Dragon Balls will be gone! Stop me, you say? Yeah, right. Don't make me laugh, brat! I've got no choice! Kid Gohan cannot hit downed opponents very well, but he makes up for this by being able to keep them standing and by locking them into combos. His attack power isn't the best, but it certainly isn't the worst. <laughs> You rot! 
This is where it ends! No! Evil King Piccolo. Protecting some kid. Nothing could be worse. <laughs> this is you and your father's fault. Your soft heartedness must have wore off on me. Thanks, Gohan. You're the only one who ever treated me like a friend. Gohan. Goodbye, my friend. Thank you. showed up. What's with that look on your face? I don't like it. <laughs> Is this how badly you want me to kill you? You guys are going to pay for this! Vegeta! What is Kakarot's power ha! level? It's over 9,000! Over 9,000! It's got to be some kind of mistake! It's a malfunction! This scenario doesn't give you a one-hit kill win like the last one. Rather, you need to reduce Nappa's health to zero as Goku to clear it canonically. I don't have use for you anymore. Goku has gained tremendous power, but Vegeta seems to exceed even that. All right, let's go. Goku manages to take out Nappa. However, Vegeta may be a problem. Goku is in a fight for his life against Vegeta, who's powered up to the max. All right, there won't be any people or animals around here. <laughs> you should be pleased, a low-class warrior like you. 
seldom gets to play with an elite like me. All Saiyans are inspected for their combat skills at birth. And you were thrown out with the rest of the trash. And that's how I wound up coming to Earth, right? I should be grateful. Besides, with enough hard work, even a low class can surpass an elite. <laughs> You're quite a comedian. Let me show you the power that no amount of hard work can overcome. What's wrong, Kakarot? You can do better than that. You look better when you beat Nappa. Disappear very soon. Even though things look really bad, I'm still having the time of my life. What are you looking at? Because I am the greatest in the universe. <laughs> Injured. I've been injured by this low-class scum. I won't stand for it. I will not stand for this. I don't need this planet anymore. I'm going to demolish you and everyone else on Earth. There's absolutely no way you can stop my Gallic gun! What do you mean? It's just like a Gallic gun! Hey, Oken! I can't stand it! I will not stand for this! Someone has a death wish! <laughs> How do you like this, Kakarot? You're finished now! A great ape? A great ape monster? Let me give you some good news. As a great ape, a Saiyan's power level increases tenfold! <laughs> What's wrong? Run yeah! away! Defeat Great Ape Vegeta to clear the scenario. How can this be? You seem to be overpowering him quite easily. I finally made it. <laughs> I almost thought I was done for there.
And that was the Saiyan Saga of DBZ BT3. See you next time for the Frieza Saga. If you want to hear non-scripted commentary, head over to my channel. This is Wood Geek, and I'm out.